Hey everyone, welcome to Small Screen Reactions. My name is Andrew and I'm here to react to The X-Files Season 2, Episode 8. Very excited to watch this. Um, I'm really intrigued to see if we're, if we're gonna get... Well, at some point we're gonna have to get, um... Scully back. Sorry, playing for a moment. It's been like a week since I filmed X-Files, but, uh, yeah. It's gonna have to happen eventually and I don't know what's gonna happen and how that's gonna change the show completely. I don't know, but... Watching Mulder all alone is very sad, but if we must do it, we must. Alright, before we get into this, please don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon, the link is down below in the description box if you want to watch these episodes weeks in advance, fully uncut, and watch Patreon-exclusive shows that are only on Patreon, okay? So thank you for watching, I hope you enjoy, and without further ado, here we go. Once, when she was a girl, a very little girl. Smith Scully, please say Scully. Dana yeah, it's someone else. Wood. Oh, Dana. Yeah, we're talking about Dana. Others had given her a BB gun and were showing her how to use it. Oh, I'm learning more about Scully. I love it. Dana also shot at the snake. It squirmed wildly, desperately fighting for life. But as the boys continued to shoot... I would be sad if it was something more than a snake, but I don't like snakes, so... The snake, its blood in her hands, died. There was nothing she could do to bring it back. This is weird. Too soon, Mrs. Scully. We can't give up. Yeah, can't give up. Never give up. What's this? Oh, you're gonna get a tombstone for her? Oh, hell no. Hell no. Uh, no, 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 uh, no, and, uh, no, and, uh, no. Are we going to find another this episode? We're not getting the actress that plays the mom back just for one little scene, which means we got to focus on, and a whole flashback, too, and cast the young Scully. we got to be getting her back, right? found Scully. There we go. Hopefully. I don't know. Doubt it, but that'd be great. Okay, he's running. Maybe they did find Scully. Sir, sir you can't go in there. I don't think he cares. <gasps> we did find her. Is it at her? Is that her? Oh, damn. What happened? Where? How did she get here? Sir, will you please? How did she get here? Miss Scully was in this condition when I arrived for the evening shift. What? If you step outside, she was just in the hospital bed. Are you Doctor Daly? What the hell is going on? How did she get here? Did you settled down. Was it? Was it paramedics? Right, calm down. FBI? Calm down for a moment. Right now. Get a sign. Right where? Were you telling me she just appeared? Yeah. Sir, Who did this to her? Sir. I want to see. Let him speak. I want to see. What the hell is going on? Listen, if you're with them. Mulder, this is not helping her. He looks good in a turtleneck, though. Like, look at that turtleneck. It works well for him. My apologies, but uh, no one here can determine how Dana arrived at the hospital. She just appeared in the hospital. I can't determine with certainty how long she's been in this state. You haven't told us why she's like this. We they just don't, don't know. know, Mrs. Scully. So we know nothing. She's, she's appeared out of nowhere in the hospital bed. I'd like her examined for trace evidence. Uh, she's been bathed and cleaned since her admittance. Of course. Also, there is uh, the FBI has notified us of the terms of Dana's living will. What? What is it? What did she say? Mulder. Well, Dana, her criteria for terminating life support oh, no. is quite specific. Oh no. She stays if her Glasgow outcome scale lists her. She doesn't want to live in this condition. No, no. There's a way to get her out of this. But how? Is her witness. <sighs> Who is she? Sister? Okay. I've been told not to call you Fox. <laughs> By who? Dana? Yes, ma'am. Just now, can she talk to her spiritually? Whether to remain or move on. 
Normally I'd be like, oh, fuck this stupid shit. Don't believe it. But for Dana's sake, I hope so. Oh. Scully! Oh, she's on a boat? Oh, don't go towards death. She's just staring. Okay. She's not here. What are you about to do? Oh, is this a signal to like get your man to come and talk to you? Okay, so your deep throat is not helping you. Who are you? Dana Scully, please. What? Fro Hickey? Fro Hickey. Who? Oh, oh, okay, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Took me a minute to realize who he was. This is weird. Good work sneaking out these charts. Mm -hmm. Tuck them in my pants. <laughs> There's plenty of room down. You look down, <laughs> Tell you what, you're welcome to. We're all hopping on the internet to nitpick the scientific inaccuracies of Earth, too. I'm doing my laundry. Mm -hmm. The chart shows abnormal pro. I downloaded Scully's medical data to the newest lone gunman. He goes by the name The Thinker. This guy's a hacking the thinker. genius. The Thinker reports the protein chains are the byproducts of branched DNA. Branched DNA. Branched DNA. It's the cutting edge of genetic This is way beyond cutting edge. This is technology 50 years down the line. What's it used that for? Either aliens or government has. You mean a high-tech identity card? Or something as insidious as grafting a human to something inhuman. Oh, Good theories, the gentlemen, but all for waste product. Whoever was experimenting on Scully is finished. Now it's nothing more than a biological poison. So what if we get it all out? Um, her immune system has been decimated. Oh, damn. And... Dana, come back! I'm here to take care of you, sweetheart. Watch over you. Help you find the way home. She's like right there, so close. Only when it's time. I'll be here when you need me, dear. Seems to be a very nice nurse, okay. Excuse me, sir. This actress, she has played multiple roles on this show already. Oh no. Oh, I thought it was Dana. Crash cart. Crash cart in. And that guy's about to take the blood sample. Government. Yep. Why does the government have to interfere with everything? No, 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 no. God damn. Playing here, check out every single floor. Uh, uh. Go, go, go. Watch out, watch out, watch out. Yep, yep. <laughs> I didn't oh. expect you here to oh. visiting hours. There was a man. He took Scully's blood. Forget him. Get that. No, don't forget him. City compact six. Our forty caliber weapon is pointed at your head to stress my insistence. Why are you sweaty and frantic? Respirator desist immediately. You ignore my call, Robin. You expect me to do what you say. You, you got, got him. You got him oh, killed. Okay. You got her killed. That's not. She's not dead yet. Happened to me. You might too. You understand? Oh. Oh. I come to you <laughs> when I need you. Right Fuck now, you. you're heading in a direction that can lead. That's the point. I owe her more than just sitting around doing nothing. Yeah. She's a good soldier, Mojo, but there's nothing you can do to bring her back. Yes, there is. She's not a damn schoolboy, Mojo. You have no idea. No idea. 
Okay, then tell me. Tell me. Yeah. Give a little light on something. Put a little light on this. Come on, tell us what's going on. I used to be you. For what? I was where you are now. Really? But you are not. I don't think you have the heart. Uh, I think he's a lot of heart. Grieve for Scully and then never look back. No. You will be able to live with yourself, Mulder. Is this guy still here? Federal agent. Oh, oh god. Shoot him. Where is he going? Federal agent, you know I'm armed. Don't turn around. Ooh. Put your gun very the slowly on you? the ground. Who wants this? Who wants yeah, it? Speak. Speak, man. Oh god, oh god, oh Oh, oh Damn Oh, ah, uh, ah uh. Nice, thanks for kind of like coming and helping hand A little, little help finally Stay there Wait Oh You wanna see what it takes to find the truth, Agent Mo You wanna know the things I know? Kind of do. Ooh. I'll attend to this. Okay. So wishy washy, man. Like, I can't help you. You gotta stop. Let her die. And now you're helping him. Oh, make him. Make up your mind. This is not the case with your daughter, Mrs. Cully. My guess is that she's been in this state since her disappearance and she will not improve. That's a guess. You don't know. Here we are. Establishing her will. Possible branch DNA. Can or you unplug her and she suddenly wakes up. She's not a piece of evidence. She's here because of unnatural circumstances. She's dying. So let's That's save her. It's perfectly natural. Mm, there's unnatural ways. So we don't want to look at death. We have machines prolong a life that should that should end. Or we have machines bring someone back to life. Natural circumstance than any cause of her death. Yes, that's very politically correct. <laughs> That's very human. Ooh. You and Dana had a friendship built on respect. It was more than just friendship, but okay. I have lost my husband. And God knows I don't want to lose my baby girl. Ah, uh, fair. But like you, I have always respected her. But yeah, in her wishes. This is a moment for the family. He's part of the... You can join us if you want. Okay. That's nice. I thought she was about to say you can't come with us, but... Okay. Happy. But sad. I have a feeling they're going to unplug her and she's going to come back to you and be like, huh? and no memory of anything. I'm not killing Scully off. I refuse to believe it. No... Paddle back, paddle back. Come on. That's it? She's dead? Read it. It's all there. What? You if you're having trouble, Assistant Director Skinner, I'm sure you know we'd have no trouble. Who the fuck are you, though? Yeah. Fuck up. Mm. I, I swear this man. Smoker over here is just once is asking to be hit punched. Mm. You waste that cigarette where you like have one puff and then if you don't want people smoking, you also shouldn't have an ashtray, just saying. I called you right up here because of rumors about an incident at the hospital last night. Wow. Is this about the tooth that was found in the cafeteria jello? <laughs> the room you were involved in the laundry room? No, sir. Involved. The man was executed. Traces of her blood were found at the scene. May I see the police report? There is no police report of this incident, Agent Mulder, and there is no body, you know Then that. there's nothing illegal that happened. Any such incident, sir? No, how would I know that? <laughs> Get off. How's it feel? Constant denial of everything? Questions Ooh. answered with a question. He's getting sassy. Love it. I want to know what happened, damn it. Damn. 
That's what happened. Cancer man. Cancer He's man. He's responsible for what happened. How do you know that? It's a rumor. Oh. Who is he? It's not you. Oh, you can Chat, have... Who is he? We're not the mafia agent, Mulder. I know it's easy to forget, but we work for the Department of Justice. But that's what I want. Wait, do you work for the Department of Justice? Really? Or do you work for this man? We all know the field we play in, and we all know what can happen in the course of a game. If you were unprepared for all the potentials, then you shouldn't step on the field. This shouldn't be a game. And I don't think she was prepared for it to go missing and then found in a coma and die. That's not normal. I never told her. And you're as much to blame for her condition as... Don't put that on. No. It is cancer. not your fault, Mulder. Do not let that... put. Do not put that on yourself. Whoa. Uh, this is a little creepy. It's like a wedding dress. Kind of. Like a communion dress. Is she actually dead? It's her dad. But she's still not awake. To me. Life went at a proper pace. Oh, many rewards. Yeah, and she's too early. At that moment, I would have traded every medal, every commendation, every promotion oh. for one more second. We'll be together again, Starbuck. But not now. Not now, not yet. Not now. Yep. Time for her to go back. She's got work to do. You could spend the rest of your life finding every person who's responsible and it's still not going to bring her back. That's true. It may make you feel temporarily better, though. Including myself. Pardon me. Sir, do you have change for the cigarette machine? Who are you? No. There's a pack already here. More leaf. Oh. My brand. Oh. It's him. Him. Is he at the hospital? What's the message? Something in there, note. Oh. What? Uh, 900 West Georgia Street. Is Cigarette Man actually helping? Or is that his address? That someone's leading him to Cancel Man? Who's this guy? Oh. Hodge, buddy. Shut up! Shut up! Then I ask the questions. You're gonna answer me, you son of a bitch! Hey, Amen. Don't try and threaten me, Mulder. I've watched President stuff. So? Answer me! I like it. Really? Doesn't sound I like, like her it. too. That's why she was returned to you. That's what? You like her so much that you put her in a coma? No wife. No family. Some power. What power? I'm in the game because I believe what I'm doing is right. Um, what do you believe you're doing? For you to decide what's right. Yeah. Some you? random schmuck. If people were to know of the things that I know. Why? It would all fall apart. Why does everyone have to talk in riddles on the show? Ah, just let me know. And here you are with a gun to my head. I have more respect for you, Mulder. Uh, You're becoming a player. Because he's more aggressive now? You can kill me now. But you'll never know the truth. Are you gonna tell him if he doesn't shoot you then? And that's why I'll win. Fuck you. Don't worry. Start rumors. Oh, I hate this man. You cannot resignate, no. If you resignate, you'll never be able to figure out what happened and to save her. But she's gonna come back, isn't she? And then he's like, well, I don't quit now. 
Maybe. If I want to believe. I started out this room was where they kept the copier. At least back then it wasn't just wasted space. Damn. He's gonna refuse the vexation. Yeah. It's unacceptable. I agree. For once I agree with him. And myself, but in everything. There was just no point to anything anymore. Okay, and peaceful. Unafraid. I just, what you mind? Why does this room never have any light? Like <laughs> He's like such in the dark right now, it's hard to see him. Yeah, he has a good amount of light on him. I'm afraid to look any further beyond that experience. You? You are not. He's truly not afraid at looking past what freaks him out. You're stuck here. You're in the X Files. Live with it. You gave me Cancer Man's location. Oh. He hate, he does seem to not like Cancer Man. What's with the box if you're not leaving? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Your plane ticket. Plane ticket to where? We barely know each other. <laughs> I can't tell you. It's too close to me. I'm giving you the man who took her. Oh. How? They believe you'll be out of town. They believe you have information about Scully being kept in your desk in your apartment. Oh. And they they'll search your apartment. They will be armed. You will be waiting. Oh. To defend yourself with terminal intensity. Ooh. It's the only way, Mo. Trap them. The law will not punish these people. But that's not going to give you answers if you kill them. Oh, oh, sister. For a second. Yeah, but talk to her. Scully would want you to. Why is it so dark in here? Because the lights are on. <laughs> yeah, <Okay>. duh. <laughs> I can't. Not right now. Is it worth? these men and trying to kill them and getting to answers than to go say goodbye to Scully. Much darker than where my sister is. Willingly walking deeper into darkness cannot help her at all. I agree with Only her. the light is... Oh, you the harmonic conversions crap, okay? You're not saying anything to me. Mm. What don't you listen to your paranoia and your defeat? Mm. You know, just because it's positive and good doesn't make it silly mm. or trite. So much easier for you to run around trying to get even than just expressing to her how you feel. Damn. I expect more from you, Dana. Even if it doesn't bring her back, at least she'll know. Yeah. And so will you. Do you really want to not be there for her when she dies because you're waiting on some guys to get vengeance on? Good, good choice. If anything can pull her out of it, it's you. So you need to be there to help her out. Well, I'll bring you back. You never know, though. Doesn't hurt to try. But I'm here. Come on, Dana. Why do her boobs look so big right now? And why do they have a blanket on her? Why is she just like laying on top of the bed? Feels weird. Yep, they ransacked his place. He's finally dealing with the emotions. He thought he would be able to find her and save her. He didn't think she'd ever just come back and die.
I thought that was the end of the episode for a second. I was like, hell no, we're ending like that. What the hell, though? Is she waking up? Let me check the chart. Is she in the middle of the hall? She's not even, like, in a room. She's awake. Scully! Yes, yes, yes. She's back, baby. That fox, Mulder. <laughs> we missed you. Mulder, I don't remember anything. I had a feeling. After Dwayne buried. Doesn't matter right now. You're alive. That's what matters. What's your present? Superstars of the Super Bowls. <laughs> I knew there was a reason to live. <laughs> Mulder. I had the strength of your beliefs. Aww. He still has the necklace. Who's holding this for you? He loves you so much. Look at that, that little grin on his face. Can I see Nurse Owens? If there is no Nurse Owens, is there? Dana, I've worked here for 10 years. There's no nurse Owens at this hospital. Interesting. Little angel helping her out. I was going to say, she was acting very strange for a nurse. I was like, hmm, a little weird. You have a little guardian angel watching over you. Whew. Okay, so we really only had one episode without Scully. She's back now. It was a long episode of Will She Even Survive and Live? Which I knew she had to because there's so many seasons left. And we're not replacing Scalia in the middle of season two. That would be some major bullshit. But now she's back. She's alive. She has no memory of what happened. We don't know what they did with her body. So is her body going to be different? Is she going to be acting differently? Are they still going to be going, coming? Are they going to come back to get her? Who took her? Was it aliens with the government? Was it just aliens? Was it the government? It seems like it's the government was involved in some way. So we don't know if it was the aliens working with the government or just the government itself and what they did with her. Were they experimenting her and little put a little baby in her, like an alien baby? And so she had the, like, the weird DNA in her? We don't know. I guess we'll see um, what that means. Does she have an alien baby somewhere? I don't know. Oh, so many questions still. Cigarette man cancer man whatever he's a piece of work skinner better he he likes scully and likes Mulder, and he wants to help he can only do so much i get that he needs to be a little less cryptic though everyone needs to be less cryptic in the show a lot of ask a question and you get like this weirdly worded five minute answer that doesn't quite make sense or give you anything so come on make it easier to understand people give us some actual answers uh a plus b equals c that's it. I don't need a whole wood problem with it. Hmm. Uh, I'm just happy Scully's back. And hopefully they'll get back to working on the X-Files in the next episode. And it was nice to meet the sister and see the mom again. See even the dad again too. Um, so it was, it was a nice chill episode. Nothing super crazy happening. But we got Scully back. Yeah. So, very excited as you know. Alright. Thank you guys for watching once again. And please don't forget to like, subscribe, check out Patreon, and I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.